So she just literally takes a wide tooth comb, no water, no product, and just starts raking. Oh my God. Hey y'all, it's Treya, and I'm back with the horror story, with the horror story, with the horror story. I'm back ah, with the horror story, with the horror story, with the horror story. Ah! Hold on real quick, let me fix my hair. Oh, and by the way, do you guys like my hair? If you do, give this video a thumbs up. I did post a tutorial, sis, okay? It'll be up above in the eye. Check it out after this horror story, okay? Enjoy the horror story first, sis. The tutorial will be there, I promise. If you guys are new, welcome. I would love for you to hit the subscribe button. I do do a series here on my channel called Natural Hair Horror Stories where I allow you guys to email me your craziest... And it gets pretty crazy, okay? Your craziest natural hair horror story, and I feature it, I share my thoughts, and I used to let you guys weigh in in the comments before YouTube disabled them, but now YouTube enables the comments. They allow you guys to comment for like the first 10 minutes, and then they shut it off. I mean, I'll take what I can get at this point. But yeah, if you have a natural hair horror story that you'd like me to feature, definitely email me at sensitra at gmail.com, and hopefully I will feature it next Friday. So let's just get into it, okay? I hope you got your snacks, girl. Get your snacks. And let's get into it. So we're going to put the email here. And the email says, Hey, Treya, first off, love from Trinidad. Where my Trini followers at? Hey, y'all. But anywho, I recently broke my ankle really bad. I had to have surgery bad. So I was down and out when it came to happiness and especially my hair. Okay, so we jump right on into this horror story, okay? My mom was left to take care of me for a while, which she is very good at. Just can't take care of my hair. <laughs> Mom can do a lot of things, she just can't do hair. My clinic days were fast approaching and my mom is not the kind to let her child out the house a mess, sick or not, so she sits me down to do my hair. My mom is a Caribbean parent, so no, ain't an answer. She sits me down in a chair and says, I'ma go get the comb. Here's where it went left, well, well this is my left. Here's where it went left. My mommy brings out the following. A wide tooth comb, okay. A fine tooth comb, the rat tail comb, some cheap moisturizer. Sometimes them cheap moisturizers can get the job done, okay? Don't sleep on them because they're cheap, okay? And a tub of blue magic hair grease, okay? Here goes nothing. Now, Treya, my hair had been out of bonnet because she said I didn't need it for a week. Tangles everywhere. So I politely suggested she go get my spray bottle upstairs and use some water to loosen it up. To which she responded, no, <laughs> you don't need that because I'm not washing your hair now. <laughs> okay, mom, we don't just use water when we're washing our hair. <laughs> Ooh. With that, I shut up because anything else I would have said would have been deemed rude. She begins to try to deal with my hair and starts complaining. I'm not even going to attempt to do an accent because it's probably going to be bad. So she says, I can't do this hair no more. How do you take care of all this hair? Your hair is so thick. I see why you take so long to do this hair now and all other sorts. She finally decides to detangle. My hair was coming from a low puff, so my ends were very tangled, girl. I know far too well about the low ponytail struggle. <laughs> Have you guys seen my hair updates? Treya, she starts to go in with the wide tooth comb from top to bottom. I can just imagine just, ooh, can't y'all just feel that? Like, uh. No product or nothing. So she just literally takes a wide tooth comb, no water, no product, and just starts raking. Oh my God, and y'all know her hair was dry, tangled. It's been a day on ponytail like mine was in for two months. That's why I got my mini twist, y'all. See, I didn't learn my lesson this time, cause, cause, it happened again and just keep up with my hair updates okay keep up with my hair updates but that's why i'm rocking my protective style now because it was bad i can hear all my ends snapping off loudly in my ear i try to tell her to go easy to which she says your hair's too strong to break i can literally feel the tiny pieces of breakage falling on my back arm and i can also see them on the floor She decided she wants to do cornrows on my head, so she begins to part. After parting, she said my hair is so tangled again and has to be re-detangled. She had to detangle it again. She then picks up the rat tail comb and begins to detangle my tight forehead from root to tip with no moisture. 
I almost lost it. I tried telling her that's not how you detangle or even the tools you use, to which I got, you are crazy. Your hair is too strong to break off. All that hair you see is hair that's supposed to come off. <laughs> Eventually, she was done with the style and then says, time to grease that scalp. After she was done committing murder to all my strands of hair, I told myself, she ain't touching my hair again. And that's the end of the email. This was a really short story. I feel so bad because your mom was trying to help, you know? She was trying to do your hair, take care of you. But mama just ain't know what she was doing like that. You know what I'm saying? She ain't know. She ain't know. I'd suggest next time maybe pull up a video of mine to show her and be like, look, mama. That's what you're supposed to be doing, mama. Don't show her the ones when I had that ponytail in my ever two months. Don't show her that because she's going to be like, girl. <laughs> Don't show those videos. But show my more helpful videos when I was actually taking care of my hair because I do know <laughs> what to do. I just didn't do it. But um, yeah, show her some of those videos next time, you know, and hopefully you will have a better experience. And that goes to anybody whose mama is out here doing your hair. If when she's detangling, you're in pain, just show your mama some of my wash day videos. Check out the videos when I did my kids' natural hair and did their wash routines because detangling is a breeze. All you need is the proper tools, the right products, and the right technique. So make sure you check out my videos. I'll link some helpful ones down below to help your parents out a little bit, okay? But yeah, I hope that you guys enjoyed this natural hair horror story. Sorry that it was short. Give it a thumbs up anyway, okay? Give it a thumbs up anyway if you guys enjoy natural hair horror story Fridays. And I'll see you guys next Friday with another natural hair horror story. Bye, guys.